Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome. Today I'm doing an Alphalete try on and review. I have not shopped from Alphalete since about 2016. And if you're like, wow, that's a long time, let me just show you the items that I have. Check out this OG sweatshirt. Do they even still use the crest anymore? I honestly don't think so. These are like literally from back in the day. So anyway, we go way back, but it's been a long time. Now, I remember back in the day, Alphalete had some serious issues when Christian was doing everything by himself with his friends in their warehouse. And I know that things are totally different now, which is why I was finally ready to give it another chance. So I was actually influenced by Ashley Gaeta. She did a review and I was like, you know what, let's do this. So I did get the Revival bra in the bloom color. It's like a really pretty purpley pink. I got the Halo leggings in small, no, medium and large, medium and large, cause they said they ran small, so I wasn't sure. I got the Essential Crop Tank. I got that in a large and I got the Collective Thrive Tank in a large. I don't know my size. I usually take medium. Um, this is medium from Amazon and these are six from Lululemon. So I'm usually like a medium and everything, but I just went large on some of the things that seem like maybe they would run small. So let's find out together. Here we have the Halo leggings and the Revival sports bra. It is a seamless collection. So on the leggings, there's no front seam. Um, it has a high waistband. It has some detailing, kind of like contouring going down the leg. And then the sports bra, you can kind of see the cup pads through a tiny bit. Um, it has this pretty detailing. Sorry, that's just my mic. <laughs> and then kind of like a cross back. So the sports bra was $46.80 on sale. And then the leggings were $61.20 on sale in US dollars. Um, I was kind of expecting more. I've just heard so much about Alpha Elite. And I know that their Amplify leggings are like the big ones that everybody loves. So maybe just these Halo, I don't know if these are new or not as popular. Um, I mean, the fabric feels nice, but I feel like this purple color, like you can kind of see everything through. So I am wearing underwear and I feel like you can totally see like bumps from the seams of it, even though it's kind of seamless. Um, you can see like my belly ring right through. I feel like that's like super obvious. Um, if I wasn't wearing underwear, I don't really even know then what you would be seeing. And this sports bra, like given the fact that it is, what was it, $46.80? Like this doesn't feel like a $50 sports bra. Like it feels kind of like my $12 ones that I've gotten at like TJ Maxx. Um, the ones that I just like throw on for bed and they're really comfy, like it's very comfortable. But for that price, I'm like, what the heck? Um, and then these are the large. So I think it, it was weird because in the description, one thing said true to size and another thing said to size up. So I think this is the right size. I think large is correct, but they just like, they feel like they're gonna move around a lot. Like they just don't feel secure. And maybe that's part of their like seamlessness. They're like, super soft, but in that way, I don't feel like they're at all functional. Like I just, I can't see myself wearing them to work out for any type of workout. Cause I feel like I'm just going to be adjusting them nonstop. And then the sports bra, like, yeah, this could be nice on like, I don't know, upper body or something, but I somehow expected there to be slightly more support. I don't think it says it's high support, but I'm not like super big in the butts and I just feel like there's like not a lot there. And I did go with medium for the bra so I know it's not like a sizing issue. Um, you know, if I had gone with large, then I could see if it wasn't as supportive as it should be. But I think like I am a true medium for the top, but it's just not really like doing anything for me. So I'm kind of disappointed, but I do have two tops to try on. I really hope they work out because they were a final sale, but if they don't, I just figured I would Poshmark them. Um, I wanted to get free shipping and I also wanted to try a few things. I originally had 
other leggings in my cart and like every time I clicked it would be like oh this got sold out and it would make me refresh my cart so like then I would do that and then I would go to the next step and then it would be like oh this is sold out now so it was kind of like a hard checkout process it also was like very glitchy right as the sale was starting um, and the other thing was because I hadn't shopped since 2016 it like still knew my account but I had to do some like verification so at first that was kind of glitching so not like a big deal but you know there were kind of some hiccups all right so let's try the tank tops and see how those are this is the collective thrive tank this was $15 I definitely regret buying it I feel like it is not flattering me at all <laughs> like that is not cute. <laughs> that is not cute. And also like this neck is so high. Like I would never want to work out in something with a neck this high, but whatever I can put it on Poshmark or maybe, I don't know, maybe if I get into my summer bod down the line, it would fit a little better. I don't know. I mean, actually it's like, it's a little better when it's like that. Like I think when it was like pulled down, it was kind of scary. Um, it's very soft. I do really like the material. Um, it feels really nice. And it originally, like I had a different color, I think in my cart, but it sold out. I think there was like a green. So I bet like, like I look really good in dark green. And I think that probably would have been more flattering because I think it's like the light color is what's like highlighting the things that I don't want to highlight, but I do think this color combo is cute. Um, I love this color. I was just taking pictures and I'm really sad that I don't love these because I think on camera, the color is really beautiful. All right, let's try the other tank top though. This is the essential crop tank. This was $14. I definitely think this is a lot less bad than the other one. And I think the black is just like so much more flattering, obviously. Um, the little sliver of skin is kind of cute. Like, you know, if you wanted a little bit more coverage, not just a sports bra, but like you don't want to be hot and you want to have something cute and cropped, I think this would actually really do the trick. Um, this is a slightly more cottony feeling material. So um, just be aware, like, it might not be quite as cool and wicking as the other one but I like the neckline a lot more. Oh, I didn't show you the back, I'm sorry. Um, and the back on both of these was just like simple racer back. So pretty standard, um, you know, I, I think it's worth $14. I probably don't think it's worth whatever the full price would have been. I think that, I don't know if it was like 35 or something. Um, you know, I, Again, like I feel like you could get something like this at like TJ Maxx for a similar price. I don't know. I really wanted to love this stuff. I recently tried Buff Bunny and loved it so much. And not that they're actually related, but like in my mind, I was like, okay, like that's like one of the brands that people have been like asking me to try and other people have said, oh, try Alphalete and I was just like hesitant to um, from kind of like past experiences, but I really wanted to give it a shot. So I'm a little disappointed and maybe it's just the pieces that I picked. Maybe when they do like an Amplify legging launch, I should look into that because those are supposedly like amazing. So I don't know, maybe this just wasn't the collection for me. So let me know down below if you think I should send the leggings and sports bra back completely. That's kind of what I'm leaning towards. Unfortunately, I can't return the two tops um, because they were final sales. So this one I actually like, like I, I can totally wear this. The other one I'm gonna have to sell on Poshmark, <laughs> like no. So if you wanna buy it from me, <laughs> check out my Poshmark. Um, but let me know what you think. Have you tried Alpha Lee? Do you like anything in particular from them? Let me know because I do, I do wanna try them again. I really wanna try the Amplify leggings but they just didn't have any in stock for me to buy this time around. I thought this color was gorgeous and I was willing to give it a shot, but I just don't know that it worked out. So 
Definitely subscribe though. You know, I'm always gonna be honest in these reviews. This is probably the most honest one I've had. I mean, they're always super honest, but most negative one, unfortunately. But you win some, you lose some. So subscribe for more. Uh, let me know some other brands I should be trying and I will see you in the next video soon. Have a great day, stay positive, bye.